Chevrolet 3500 frame chassis. Uh, it's got Dana 40s, Dana 60. So 40 for the front, 60 for the rear. Yeah. Six lug. Uh, like I said, custom wheels. Uh, and who, who's the guy that owned this? Randy Moore. He was driver of War Wizard. He made those wheels on CNC though. It's got a digital dash, all blue digital gauges. Flip the key on that. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll let the masters do. I'll break something. I'm famous for breaking things. <laughs> How stiff is the ride on it? How stiff? Yeah. A little bit not as bad as you think. Even not, on the road, not a wooden wagon type no, stiff? No, 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 no. The famous grill they look for for, what, yeah, two years? <laughs> Almost two years, find it by accident. He was on the verge of spending two grand on a vehicle just to buy the grill, and then he found, basically found it shopping for another vehicle. We got the, we got the original logo. Sixty-eight more. Do the LEDs on this work? Yes. Good airbag. Nice airbag. <laughs> yeah. Nice airbag. <laughs> I totally forgot to do the exiting part of the video and ask a couple questions. What do y'all think that truck is worth? Because he wants my truck plus a little on top of what uh, giving him my truck. So what do y'all truly think that truck's worth? Throw your comments down below. Let me know what you all think. Uh, I think he's asking a little bit much for on top of my truck because my truck is a pretty nice build along as that one's a pretty nice build. Both trucks need a few little things fixed and everything. So I feel like he's asking a little much, but you all let me know down in the comments. What would you do in my situation? How much would you give on top of my truck, or if you had the truck, how much extra would you give on top of the Power Stroke for that Jeep truck? It's an awesome truck. It's on a 3500 chassis, so I mean, it can pull just as much as my truck can pull. It's just a matter of the fuel mileage would just be ridiculously horrible. <laughs> but it would be cool to pull our Jeep behind that big Jeep. That would be pretty cool. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Stop by for the first time. Please subscribe. You all have a great day.